2013 and 17 question paper from the following balance sheet of nisha limited and additional information prepare cash flow statement equity share capital it's 13 lakh and 15 lakh which indicates that there is a increase in share capital to the extent of 2 lakhs so 2 lakh is a total increase in the share capital however there is an adjustment relating to it we will look into later gr last year it's 2 lakh current year is 2 lakh 50000 which indicates 50000 is gr transfer operating activity add pl account last year 1 lakh 20000 current year 1 lakh 80000 which indicates that the net profit is 60000 bank long term loan last year 3 lakh and current year 2 lakh which indicates that the loan is repaid to the extent of 1 lakh finance activity creditor is a current liability so it will come in operating activity so there is a increase in creditor of 60000 add bills payable is a current liability so it's a operating activity there is a decrease in bp of 20000 so you should minus next provision for tax you need to prepare an account because there is an adjustment proposed dividend you need to prepare an account because there is an adjustment goodwill last year 30000 current year 10 20000 which indicates a 10000 is decreased so it is called goodwill return off to the extent of 10000 operating activity add so land and building last year 7 lakh 50000 current year it's 1 lakh sorry 10 lakh there is an adjustment related to land and building so you should prepare an account plant and machinery there is an adjustment so you should prepare an account investment it's 13 1 lakh 35000 last year and current year it's 1 lakh which indicates investments are decreased so decrease in investment is treated as sale 35000 investing activity stock is a current asset so it will come in operating activity there is a decrease in stock to the extent of 1 lakh so you should add debtor is a current asset so operating activity there is a increase in debtor to the extent of 1 lakh 2000 so you should minus opening bank 1 lakh 50 closing bank 88000 so 88000 should be our resulting answer that should reflect in cash flow statement prelim expenses it's a operating activity so 20000 last year 15000 current year so 5000 decrease so decrease in preliminary expenses is called prelim expenses written off so you should add in operating activity depreciation return of during the year end 31 3 10 on plant and machinery is 1 lakh 20000 as explained earlier all adjustments will come in two places so 1 lakh 20000 will come in plant and machinery account and operating activity equity shares were issued against the acquisition of assets of another company the asset consisted of land and building worth 1 lakh 50000 and stock worth rupees 50000 so total is increase in share capital is 2 lakh if you look at the balance sheet equity share capital last year 13 lakh current year 15 lakh so increase in equity share capital is 2 lakh that means 2 lakh shares are issued against purchase of two assets two assets are purchased land and building 1 lakh 50000 and stock 50000 so total you get 2 lakh so 2 lakh assets are purchased and 2 lakh equity shares are issued so therefore you are supposed to take in finance activity only 50000 stock because stock is a current item and share is a non current item so only stock 50000 will come in cash flow statement in finance activity no depreciation has been provided on land and building during the year absolutely no depreciation at all for land and building a dividend of 13500 received during the year it's not paid it's received so it is treated as an income so you should deduct from operating activity and add in finance activity i repeat deduct in operating activity 
because it is non operating income remove minus deduct in operating activity add in finance activity provision for tax and proposed dividend shall be treated as non current liability so provision for tax and proposed dividend specifically they mention that it is non current liability therefore you need to prepare an account now you need to prepare land and building account students bring down the opening balance of land and building 7 lakh 50000 then purchase of land and building through issue of shares 1 lakh 50000 then closing balance 10 lakh so you get a differencing figure 1 lakh as purchase of land and building 1 lakh account and machinery is an asset to balance brought down 6 lakh by depreciation given in the adjustment 1 lakh 20000 balance carry down 8 lakh so you get 9 lakh 20000 minus 6 lakh you get 3 lakh 20000 purchase of plant and machinery next proposed dividend account see students clearly they have mentioned proposed dividend and provision for tax is a non current liability so you should prepare an account so but however no adjustment is given like dividend paid or tax paid whatever as explained in the theory i repeat as explained in the theory introduction to cash flow statement points to be remembered i have mentioned that if no adjustments are given regarding proposed dividend and provision for tax opening will be treated as paid closing will be treated as provided so here opening proposed dividend is 1 lakh it's a liability 1 lakh brought down that old balance opening balance we assume it is paid so balance brought down 1 lakh is called dividend paid 1 lakh closing balance 1 lakh 75000 is called 1 lakh 75000 proposed dividend provided so students opening balance 1 lakh is assumed to be paid closing balance is assumed to be provided so 1 lakh is a dividend paid in the current year 1 lakh 75000 is a dividend provided for future so opening balance is assumed as paid closing balance is assumed as provided next provision for tax it's a liability balance brought down as explained earlier students in the proposed dividend no adjustment is given regarding provision for tax so opening is assumed to be paid closing is assumed to be provided so 45000 tax is paid 60000 is a tax provided in the current year out of profit to be paid in future so net profit 60000 add gr transfer 50000 add increase in credit or 60000 add goodwill return of 10000 add in uh, decrease in stock 1 lakh add preliminary expenses return of 5000 add provision for tax provided 60000 add proposed dividend provided 1 lakh 75000 add depreciation 1 lakh 20000 so total add item 6 lakh 40000 students remember tax provided dividend provided will come in oa tax paid dividend paid will come in ia less uh, decrease in bp 20000 less increase in debt are 1 lakh 2000 less dividend received 13500 so cash flow from operating activities 5 lakh 4500 next sale of investment 35000 less purchase of plant and machinery 3 lakh 20000 less purchase of land and building 1 lakh so you get cash flow from investing activity 3 lakh 85000 next you need to find out finance activity issue of shares only to the extent of stock 50000 because stock and shares are current and non current and next the dividend received 13000 you should add so less bank loan paid 1 lakh less dividend paid 1 lakh less it paid 45000 so cash flow from finance activity you get 1 lakh 81500 minus it indicates there is a cash outflow its cash flow statement so cash flow from operating activity plus 5 lakh 4500 
Next cash outflow from investing activity minus 3,85,000. Cash outflow from finance activity minus 1,81,500. So you get minus 62,000. Add op uh, opening cash balance and bank balance 1,50,000. So you get a resulting answer of 88,000 as closing cash balance. Okay, students, kindly try. Any doubts, please ask me. Thank you.